Ferrari. It would be much better to discover Singapore with these two little ones. We found the, for the perfect parking already for them. And I want to not bother you with facts. I want to show you Singapore through my eyes and my own experiences. We are now taking one of the park connectors to go to the city center. The park connectors are a series of green corridors linking Singapore parks and gardens. We are here in front of the Bugis Street Market and it's one of the biggest uh, markets in Asia, indoor markets in Asia. Here we are in another of the food courts, of the many food courts Singapore has to offer. I took some uh, chicken nolos. It's a Thai dish, apparently. We are now biking along Orchard Road, which is uh, the most famous uh, shopping street in Singapore. You have some upscale shopping, but not only that, and it's one of the major avenues of Singapore. Let's go! located in Chinatown and as the name says it, it houses what the Buddhists regard as the left sacred tooth of Buddha which was recovered from his cremation pyre. It is housed in a giant stupa made of 320 kilograms of gold. Unfortunately we could not film that. Singapore Chinatown is really the cleanest Chinatown I have ever seen. And here's where we took the best satay ever. In the evening, the street is close to traffic and the mini satay stalls are claiming their spot by setting tables all over the street.
Clark Kay, Robertson Kay, and Riverfront are all next to each other and by the Singapore River is where the main Singapore night action is happening and is full of restaurants, nightclubs and bars which are housed in restored warehouses and more Chinese junks. Well, let's 
The East Coast Park is a beach park stretching from Marina East to the southern eastern coast of Singapore. With its scenic coastline of over 15 kilometers, it's a perfect place for biking, and there are many bike rental shops along the way. Our time has ended in Singapore, so we need to say bye to the city. In a couple of hours, our flight is heading to Bali for our next adventures. We love this city. It's a paradise for shopping, for going out, for eating, and for many activities. But what we like the most is to see how so many cultures and religions are living so close together in harmony. This should be a clear example for any country that it's possible. And we also enjoyed a lot biking here. It is, we needed to be a little bit created around it as there's not so, my, so many biking lanes at the moment, but they already did a good job with their park officers. Bye Singapore, see you next time. <laughs>